what's going on guys so today we're going to be using the new Toro battery commercial mower I'll try to get you some film here we're going to mow this there's a lot of uh customers out here all right so let me get this out of the way Now, if you're gonna ask, how long does the battery last? I don't know, okay? This is my first time using this on a property anywhere, first, first time, okay? So the goal is, I'm gonna use it as much as possible. Okay, let me see, right now I have, Okay, we're full. We're full and I'm going to mulch with this. So like I said before guys, this is the first time that I'm using this and I'm gonna use it on auto instead of max, okay? Auto, the blades are turning nice and fast, but on max, it gives it that extra kick, even though the engine auto, on its own will eventually uh, pick up the uh, the torque um, anytime you hit heavy tall wet grass all right so there will be a review coming on this but as of right now I want to go ahead and just uh, you know mow with it and see how long the battery lasts all right okay let me get a tripod and get hot Where's the tripod? Where's the tripod? Oops. Tripod. Oh man, the sun is coming out. Awesome. Look at that, guys. It rained this morning. It rained last night. Our lawns were getting kind of dry, so I'm kind of happy it rained. All right. So before we begin mowing, I want to edge with my Husqvarna 520 ILX battery trimmer and just get nice crispy edges on this property. Now, I know you're seeing the grass look kind of funky right there. The, uh, this is brand new sod that the uh, customer had installed by another company and some of it has taken and some hasn't so most likely he's gonna have those uh, strips right there replaced not sure what's going on there but hey it is what it is right nothing in life is perfect so I'm edging everything up and 
here, I don't have a set pattern that I'm doing. This is, I want to say this was like my seventh property of the day. So I was kind of like, you know, in a go mode. Yeah, I could have easily picked up the true green little flag. But like I said before, sometimes we do things that we see on video and then you wonder, <laughs> why did I do that? Right. This is my seventh property and I'm just now changing the batteries. All right, good. Brand spanking new battery. And for those who are interested, I get six to seven properties depending on the size of the property per battery uh, charge on these uh, Husqvarna trimmers. But again, it all depends on your scale. And how much you have to trim so because like I said if I get six or seven properties doesn't mean that you're gonna get six or seven properties or you may get more who knows but right now we are servicing weeklies all our properties are weekly properties this time of the year because uh, southern turf you know how that works the hotter it gets the faster it grows. So on this side, this is uh, Bermuda grass. Can you believe that? This little teeny strip. Everything else is centipede, but that little teeny strip right there is Bermuda. Yeah, so what you can do, right? Just try to make it as nice as possible. So I wanna just trim this up real quick and just finish up what I'm doing. And we're gonna begin uh, mowing here in a second. Right, guys like I said before I did a uh, unboxing video uh, and I'll place it up here if some of you guys want to check it out and I kind of talked about just a little bit about the mower and the uh, features that it has but um, for those who didn't get a chance to uh, actually check out the unboxing video the deck is uh, aluminum so it's not a I don't want to say flimsy, but it's not a homeowner type thing, um, deck, okay? So it is a little bit heavy. I don't know the exact weight of the mower, but it's, uh, I want to say, just by picking it up myself, it's probably about 50, 60 pounds. This mower um, is, is heavy. It's heavy. It's not one of those mowers that you can just pick up and put in the back of your, uh, your car. For your truck okay the tires are rubber um, and pretty thick rubber and everything is, is constructed uh, extremely heavy duty the bagger is I want to say it's like 2.1 bushels and it doesn't have a side discharge so it is either a mulch 
you know, either you're mulching or you're bagging. Okay? And here I'm just using a regular speed. I'm not using a max speed. And uh, like I said before, this feels like, I mean, it feels like a commercial mower. And this is my honest uh, opinion of my first time. This is my first, first time actually just using this. I, I haven't had any uh, time to try it out or anything like that. But yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty high speed. <laughs> so according to Husqvarna, well, according to Toro, I'm sorry about that, uh, the 60 volt battery takes 120 minutes to charge and you can go from you know all the way low from one inch up to 4.5 inches on this mower uh, like I said again you know you can either mulch or bag and it's 2.1 bushels and uh, you can cut up to 0.4 acres on a single charge so there it is 0.4 acres on a single charge okay um, and like I said before guys it feels uh, pretty good it feels like a regular mower you know um, most of the time when you get these battery powered mowers they they tend to feel like toys okay that's why I keep saying that it feels like a regular mower because you know you and some of you guys have probably tried it before you know they feel like you know you it doesn't give you that sense of uh, you know you're out there utilizing this more it, it feels it feels like a toy this one doesn't feel like a toy and the good thing about it guys you don't have to worry about uh, oil changes you don't have to worry about purchasing oil purchasing air filters you know none of that stuff man that's what I like about it and uh, yeah so I'm looking forward to using this mower and I will make a couple of more videos so you guys can see uh, the quality of cut because at the end of the day guys it's about the comfort and the end product that's my whole thing the end product I want to ensure that my customers are getting that quality of cut that we are known for so and this one is giving it to me I'm not gonna lie this one is just giving it to me and we're gonna keep uh, doing what we do and I'll keep letting you guys know what I think about, you know, this mower. Man, this is the most realistic feeling mower. When I say realistic, it feels just like the gas powered mower the only difference is the sound um i love the handles i love everything about it um it cuts wonderful look at that beautiful and this customer is, likes it uh real real tall um so let me mow this side and uh yeah see what it looks like it's kind of hard to get you guys a shot you know what I mean I'll get you a shot at this part now on this side guys I'm going to bring it down some because the customer wants this side to be mowed the same height as his neighbor and this side, as you can tell, it's a mixture of just grass. You know, it has some Bermuda in there. It has some centipede in there. Just a little bit of everything. So I'm bringing the deck down to get it uh, the same height as his neighbor. So we can kind of, you know, make it look real nice for him.
right guys so this is my initial my initial thoughts on this mower oh wow flex a coin and I threw it right back on the ground um, I love it it feels very very comfortable uh, in my hands it feels I promise you it feels like an average uh, commercial 21 inch mower the only difference is the sound but it cuts it feels uh, everything about it is, is, is great initial thoughts awesome and look at the cut look at that cut that is nice so what I'm gonna do guys is continue on using this mower uh, until the battery depletes and I, I can give you an honest opinion of time frame that I've gotten with this and uh, we do weekly properties right now so I'm not, I'm not cutting tall grass and, and none of that so um, if that's what you're trying to find uh, I'm not the uh, channel for you um, we do detail work so and this is a nice nice cutting mower extremely extremely happy with the with the cut so again stay tuned guys and uh, we'll continue on this journey because right now I am really I'm really really uh, I'm really happy with the initial performance um, and as you, guys, as you guys can tell excuse me I need to bring this up to my height I got it kind of too low so I, I will bring this up and I will do a uh, an initial video guys okay I'll do an initial video for you um, just kind of talking about the more and what it has to offer and the different features it has okay all right What's going on, man? How's everything? Doing good. I like the video. Let's check them out. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Appreciate it. As a matter of fact, you're on one right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right. Appreciate you, man. There you go. That's what it's all about. I'm telling you. Hi, man. <laughs> Run out of gas.
Now my headphones are only for our music. But check that out guys. Look at that. Beautiful cut. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Alright. Let's get up out of here. It's been raining off and on. Look at the clouds. It's been raining off and on the whole day. Which, like I said before, I'm not complaining. Because we haven't been getting uh, rain for the longest, man. I'm talking about probably three, four weeks, close to a month. Yep. So no complaints. All right. And for you guys that are curious, and I have this automated, but I just wanted to show you what I do. Um, it's my little list. Yes, I have it on my phone, but. All right, see you on the next one.